one, welcome to the standard of complex number. In this case, you are required to obtain the, the modulus and the argument of this number, given that z is equal to negative root 3 plus i. So the first thing you can decide to sketch uh, this case, you have x-axis is the real part, and you have the imaginary on the y-axis. So in this case, negative 3 is somewhere here, root negative 3 is somewhere here, and i. So our argument will be this angle on the second contract. And we are going to use the fact that uh, it's negative. So the result here will be pi minus our argument, which we want to obtain. We are going to use also the fact that argument, argument of z will be given by tan inverse of y of x, uh, whereby z is equal to x plus i y. So that is the, the general case, and that is the one we are going to employ in our case. Now, in our case, uh, our argument of z will be given by tan inverse of uh, our y is, our y in that case is, one uh, here we have one divided by divided by root three root three the negative just depicted the location whereby we are seeing it is in the second uh, quadrant whereby the tan in the second quadrant is negative so from the calculator tan inverse of one over root three is going to give you pi over 6, pi over 6, which of course if you want you can write 180 divided by 6, which is the same as that degrees. Now, but now from our diagram, from what you are given, our argument is in the land contract, meaning that we will have pi divided by pi over 6 which is equal to 5 pi over 6. So this is the argument of our given uh, equation, whereby we have, we have z is equal to negative root 3 plus i. That is our argument. The next thing, you, 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 we want to get modulus. z modulus will be given by x squared plus y squared as square root. So in our case, Remember, in our case, we are given z here, it is this one. So our x z modulus will be given by negative root of 3. We square that, then plus 1 squared as square root, which will give you a 3 plus, 3, 3 plus 1 square root, which is equal to 4, square root of 4, which will give you 2. It is going to give you 2. Uh, and that is the, our result. So I want to give you assignment, assignment, assignment. You are going to find, find the modulus, the modulus and argument of so do this and uh, let me uh, know the feedback from you. A, A root 2 plus 2i, B negative root 5 plus 3i, C uh, 1 plus i, D, 3 plus i. Kindly attempt this. In each case, you are doing, you are getting the modulus and the argument. Int, 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 which I'm giving you. Note that uh, when you have z is equal to x plus i, y, z modulus is given by x squared plus 
y squared then you get square root and the argument of z argument of z is given by tan inverse of y over x so using this this int of argument is tan inverse of y over x y is the value where where the complex part is and the x is the real part and also the modulus of z is x squared plus y squared and then you get square root kindly and do the following and send your comment uh, and let me know how you found uh, this exercise so thanks so much for taking your time to study with me on the arithmetic of complex numbers for more such studies kindly tune on to my youtube channel so that we may continue learning together also if you are a new and you find this video useful uh, remember to subscribe and also to share with the other scientists so that we may continue learning together bye bye see you in the next presentation